Hey everyone, enjoy the show. How you doing today? So another beautiful restoration came out of the shop. For those of you who watch our videos, you see we do quite a few antique safes. They really are, they sell very well, so we keep buying them, we keep building them, and they keep going away. I am always looking for different themes for the safes. Everybody does Wells Fargo. I've done a lot of Wells Fargo in my career. I'm just kind of over it. Although, if you wanted one, call me. But I like to do different themes these days. I personally started going to Virginia City, Nevada when I was probably eight or nine years old with my father. Since then, I have probably been there 30 or 40 times. Virginia City is just out of Carson City in Nevada. It's up in the mountains and it's one of the most famous silver mining towns that there ever have been. Just a super nice, it's still open, it's still running. At the turn of the century, they were probably 25 or 30 really nice saloons. And as time has passed, they've pared down to, there's probably around five left. And the Bucket of Blood is one of them that has been there from the very beginning and is still open today. I always love that saloon. They still have a lot of the great old decor in it. It's pretty much unchanged. It's super cool. Uh, if you like old Western mining towns, I suggest you go to Virginia City. It is a super neat place. So I wanted to go with the theme of the Bucket of Blood Saloon in Virginia City which you see I've done. So as always, the safe comes in, it gets completely stripped, sanded, filled. We go with the beautiful jet black car paint. Uh, this come out is super, super, super nice, beautiful. I like to buy safes also that are 30 inches and below. They're easy to move, they're nice looking, they're small. I try to stick with that, right? I really don't buy them over 30 inches. They start getting big. So once again, this is the Bucket of Blood Saloon. You'll see in the stills, this thing is striped all the way around. Uh, I had my graphic artist guy come in. Everything you see on this safe is hand painted. There's no decals, no stickers, no vinyl, no nothing. Everything is hand done. So we got the Bucket of Blood Saloon. This has been their logo for all these years. As you see, it's a bucket of blood spilling out. So it was owned and still is, I believe, by McBride and Sons. So the Bucket of Blood Saloon, it was established in 1876, if I can see right, Virginia City, Nevada. Once again, it's all hand done. You'll see in the stills, the sides are all striped. Everything's been taken off. The lock has been serviced. You have to take this whole mechanism out in order to chrome it, right? So everything goes out for plate. Now what I do is, as you see this little piece of tape here, this safe is open, okay? I can lock it and it's locked, closed. Uh, let me go over the particulars here. So here's the inside. The inside panel as well is striped. And then we have, which is not that common, some of them do, but most of them don't have an interior security door, which this one does. I don't have my glasses, so I'm going to give this a shot. Here. Come on, Jeff. Jesus Christ, come on. Oh, here's my glasses. <laughs> come on, old man. Anytime, homie. <laughs> Uh, so, the other beautiful thing, see, is I just put the bucket in here. Once again, that's all hand painted. Nice job. Then you got the interior of it here, which is your typical safe. And then you have a lock box here, which is for would be like gold, silver, etc. So, it's a, a small locking box inside the safe. Uh, what most of you probably don't know is that these. People figure these were always for money. They weren't necessarily for money. Because back when, Virginia City, I believe, burnt down twice, okay? So these were really fireproof safes because people kept their paperwork and their valuable uh, paper, like grant deeds, birth certificates, anything they were, because if, if the building burnt down, the only thing that would be left was standing would be the safe, and it was gonna keep your stuff protected. So just a beautiful, beautiful piece. I would be proud to own it, which I do at the moment, but I'm sure I won't for long. Now, what happens is I clearly have the combinations all set up. When I send this safe out to you, it will come with this piece of tape on here, and this will be, it will be open. You're gonna get the safe, you're gonna take the combination, you're gonna practice unlocking and locking it 
with the door open till you get comfortable with it. Sometimes I have people call me up and say, hey, I can't get the safe open because they're doing something wrong. They didn't practice. So please practice just opening. You're gonna spin the dial, you're gonna get your combination, then you're gonna open and close it. Do it a few times, that way you're gonna be happy and you know it works well and you have the combination to open it. Uh, this is super nice, I think you're gonna enjoy it. And as always, what happens with this is once you purchase it, it will go next door to Orange County Crating. It will be professionally crated and it will go on a truck with a lift gate. It will come to your home or business. They will take it off the truck, either put it in your garage or in your driveway. You will unbox it and put it in place, okay? It's, it's easy as one, two, three with us. You just give us a call if you'd like, give us a credit card, send us a check, we don't care. Uh, we get it next door, it goes. Just make a phone call and you'll get this thing in a week and a half. That's simple. And as always, we appreciate you watching our videos because you all are chiming in on it. Uh, you're putting us on watch. Uh, we sell a lot of stuff like this could possibly sell in the next 20 minutes once we throw it up on Instagram. Then it goes to YouTube, then it goes to eBay. So if you watch, you'll get to see all of our videos. We do a lot of interesting stuff here. Uh, I, I probably get 10 phone calls a day or emails a day here at the store, which is uh, 3,600 a year to answer, which is a bunch. So we stay real busy, beautiful, safe. You want it, just get a hold of us. We'll get it next door, we'll get it shipped, and it can be yours. And as always, thanks for watching our videos. So uh, we really want to tell you we appreciate you watching our videos. We've done about 1,600 of them to date, and uh, you guys respond very nicely to it, and we really appreciate it. So if you like them, man, smash the subscribe button, right? Boom, hit the subscribe button and click on the reminder button, and if you do that, you will get reminded. There's a little bell there. Click on that. Uh, what we'd like you to do is make comments, and please make sure you share it with your friends. You guys are taking us to the top of the YouTube channel, and if you do those three things, you'll be able to see uh, us real time, especially if you hit the bell to remind you. It'll come up every time on your phone. We try to do a lot of fun stuff for y'all, and we appreciate you watching our videos. So let's smash it, let's grab it, let's watch them, let's comment, let's send us comments, share it with your friends. If you do that, you'll take us to the top, and we would really appreciate it. Antiques. These are Mantiques. Antique, Mantique. These guys sell Mantiques. This is their store. We're picking, we're bringing stuff every day, in and out, in and out, in and out. We're, we're, we're shaking and baking. These are their customers. Give me the rundown on the GMC. This lived in a bar in Ghent, in Belgium. Follow Jim and Jeff from nine to five or after hours as they buy, sell, and restore the coolest stuff for the coolest collectors worldwide.